we see Tell on the tape for La Guerrera. 2 0 here on Karate Combat. Last time out, she took a good decision win over Anna Laura Prasotti. And there we see debutant Erica Santos here for the first time on Karate Combat. A very accomplished Karateka throughout the Pan Am and South American Games, though. Now, Bass, as we look to get underway here in round number one, both these ladies are aware of each other. They've uh, been around a lot of the same competitions, but due to different weight classes, have never actually met before. So, it'll be interesting to see. Uh, how much they've taken from watching each other fight before. Yeah, you saw Santos wanted to shake hands, but Ma Molina, she said, no, it's not going to happen. Whoa, very oh, nice. Oh, and getting it. short shots in there, getting stuck oh, in. Oh, don't Ta fight Ta Akiyama. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they, you can't hold and punch, but they were going to give it a go anyway. Referee Sam Amini has to get stuck in there and break them up. And Molina Bass. was super composed until that <laughs> happened, and then she completely went back to the first game. Oh, both last these time. ladies have come to throw down, and there we go, clinching up again. Short shots on the inside. Looks for the throw. The right hands keep working. Oh, back to guard here. Nice counter, taking and countering. I love that. That's what I do. So you got to count, counter that uh, kick with a nice right straight. Exactly what she did. That's why I always say, don't set it up with a single kick because it can simply take it and counter all the time. 70% of the knockouts are because of that. Lead. I love how close their lead hands are to each other, Bass. It's like it's, it's how yeah, how much it. range can we keep without really keeping range? It's great. Yeah. Oh, oh, nice head right hand. Big right, right hand. hand. Oh. There we go. She eats two. Molina's doing great. Santos is rumbled. Just let go. Push your waist. Let's create distance. Oh, and Santos was in trouble there for a couple of times. She yeah, had yeah. two good rear straights. It looked like she was dazed. Now simple left straight to the body, right straight to the head. Will do wonders. Molina actually putting her whole training camp uh, from Venezuela actually now in oh, New York. Beautiful. And that's a huge shot. Wow, that is crazy. Santos beautiful is out. shot. What a beautiful Very straight nice. shot from Omira Molina. She is going to take a clean, decisive win here. Wow, that was beautifully timed. She came in and kaboom, right on the button there. You see, as she said it, she wanted to use more space this time. Don't be too, too, that close. Let's take a look back at that knockout. Look at the laser focus Boom. and bang. Right hand straight on the chin and aggression to follow up as well. Santos not able to recover. Boom, she comes in. Oh man, this uh, is going way all the way back to the first show that we had, <laughs> right? But what's the first was our fifth show? Boom. Ooh. Look at that. Santos's head was already slightly turning as she came in. Yep. Ate that fully to the, the side of the jaw. Our referee, no choice there but to stop the bout. Lovely, clean technique from yeah. Amira Molina. Kidakos, remember? He did that as well. Yes, he did. Okay, that was also the first night fight of the night. What a start to karate combat here for tonight's action. Amira Molina watching her opponent get uh, her medical checks. Nice. We're going to go down to the center of the pit here and get the official decision. Standing victory for Venezuelan Omira Molina. Her training camp up in Yonkers, New York, paying dividends there. She's going to head up pit side and get a few words with Leila Annerley. Ahead of this fight, you said you wanted to show your discipline and clean technique. You did exactly that. How do you feel? Me siento muy contenta por el trabajo realizado junto con mi coach. Gracias por confiar en mí. Toda mi pelea se la dedico a mi hermano, que en paz descanse, mi familia. Y la verdad, la chica de Brasil, una guerrera, como siempre lo digo, siempre respeto a mi oponente. Trabajé duro 
y fui bastante disciplinada y seguiré trabajando humildemente para la próxima pelea que de Karate Kumba me dé nuevamente la oportunidad. Beautiful, beautiful clean knockout. Thank you very much. Congrats. Amara Melina victorious there. Robin, what did you see for that beautiful straight punch? You know, you can see karate everywhere you look. And in fact, you can see karate even in the sport of hockey. And that's what we saw when <laughs> Mel uh, Melina and Erica had each other and they were just pumping and pulling. That looked like a hockey fight. Not quite legal, but then what happened? She created the space and everything she was doing was to set up that straight right hand. The low kicks to set it up and just using it, using it, walked her into it, bink, and put her down. Yes, a beautiful knockout for the Venezuelan bass. Let's go ahead and take a look at some of the action from that fight. These yeah. ladies got stuck in right Ooh. from the start. That was right away from the get already. Now we go here. Takiyama don't fry style. Boom, boom. If you don't know what we're talking about, go on YouTube. <laughs> that is crazy. <laughs> now. Several Cuts. times, though, they, they had this exchange in the middle, and it was Omira Molina who just got the cleaner of the strikes. Look at the intensity oh. in her face. That was a beautiful shot. But, you know, like Robin said, you saw her setting it up. She was constantly working for it. Something 100% that was a, a game plan.